Can you count all the countries right now? Oh, okay. Let me see. <laughs> so England, France, Italy, Germany, Finland, Sweden, Estonia, Denmark, the Netherlands, Russia. I feel like I'm forgetting one in Europe. Um, hello. Hello. Hi, how are you? Uh, I cannot hear you. Can you hear me? Hold on. Um, no. No. Let's see. But you can't hear me, right? I can hear you. But I don't. Oh, I just heard you. Oh, you can hear me now? Yes. Okay, perfect, perfect. How are you doing? I'm doing okay. <laughs> I have a bit cold, so don't mind. Uh, don't mind? What should I say? It's completely okay. I hope you feel better soon. Yeah. How's the weather in your country? <sighs> Where I live, <coughs> I live in Louisiana in the United States. Um, it's kind of cold today. I was sick last weekend because of the cold weather. <laughs> mm, yeah, everybody's getting sick, I guess. Absolutely. So, uh, Where are you from? Um, I'm originally from Nepal, but I grew up in India. And I'm living in India right now. Got it. Okay, Which uh, city? Around Delhi. That probably people people know about. Yeah, um, I know Delhi. My um, my dad travels to India for business, but he's usually in Mumbai. Hmm. Yeah, Mumbai is a big city as well. Yes. Is a is a Bollywood city. Absolutely, I know my um. My other students from India are usually giving me recommendations for Bollywood movies to watch. <laughs> oh, okay. So, um, uh, where did you say you live in USA? Louisiana. It's in the southern part of the country. Have you heard of it? Louisiana. No, I mm -hmm. heard southern. So, here, I'll pull it up on a map. So you can see most of my students no, no, it's haven't right. heard of it. It's, it's all right. It's all right. I, I, I can see here. Okay. Yeah. So um. Uh. So what do you what do you do in uh, in the USA? What's my job? Yes. So I'm a certified English teacher, but when I'm not teaching and working with students on Cambly, I work as a travel agent. Oh. What is the job of a travel agent? So a travel agent plans people's trips, whether it's for fun or for business. So they plan where they're staying, what they're doing, how they're going to get there. It's a lot of fun. So. Mm. So if, uh, if I suppose I lived uh, in your country and I wanted to visit India, why would I come to you? And why, why, why can I go alone? So why would you come to me? Mm, yes. Because travel agents uh, bring a lot of benefits and advantages to their clients. So if you book through me and plan your trip <coughs> through me, I can get you um, special perks and privileges that you wouldn't get if you were just booking yourself because I am in that industry and I have partnerships with hotels. Okay. For example, like I want so to visit, I want to visit um, India, Delhi. Mm -hmm. yeah, so, so after we, you know, plan your, you know, your trip, where you're going, what you're doing, some of the things that you'll have access to are you'll arrive at your hotel. You will usually be upgraded to a better room because you booked with me. Mm -hmm. Usually get free breakfast, um, money to spend at the spa. Also, you'll have access <coughs> to um, tours and experiences that you may not have access to if you weren't booking through a travel agent. Okay. Um, 
what is the criteria to be a travel agent? It's really is no it? criteria. It's a lot of training, but anybody can enter the industry. So. Mm. So there's nothing like a certification that says. Oh, there is. Certified. Yeah, that's the that's the training part. You do need to get certified to do it, but there's no um, prerequisites behind that. You know, so if you have an interest in it, you know, you would just need to um, get accepted into an agency, and then you would go through your your certification and your training with your agency. Hmm okay so um so when did you start and why did you start so i started <coughs> i started this past summer i'd always wanted to work as a travel agent i was just trying to pick the right agency and i started because i honestly i love travel and i was already planning a lot of my family and friends trips uh, so I figured why not, you know, start getting paid for something that I'm already doing and I'm good at. Mm -hmm. so, okay. Uh, oh, I had a question about it. Yeah. Uh, tr travel. I forgot. It's okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, so you are a travel age so oh uh, yeah my question was so do you have to be under someone you do work with a host agency so my host agency is fora <coughs> fora mm -hmm. is it the name of a website or a company yeah it's the name of the company so that's the name of my host agency so that's who I did all of my training and certification through. Mm -hmm. So, so, so you work on, on your own and pay commission to the company. How yes. does it work? So hotels pay me commission for bringing clients to them. And mm. then I have to give a cut of my commission, a percentage of my commission to my agency. And then the rest is mine to keep. Oh, oh I see. Okay. And uh, I like, I like to talk business. <laughs> yeah, of course. So, um, so, so, so just, uh, from another, uh, a guy from another country can also book from you, like from, yeah, I'm in India, I, work I contact with you. Client. Yeah, no matter From where anywhere they are. in the world. Mm -hmm. Okay, so how do you get clients by your own? So a lot of it is networking in your own, you know, local networks. So like for me, for instance, I'm the first travel agent out of my family, out of all of my groups of friends. So I got a lot of business <laughs> right from mm -hmm. the beginning because everybody had no other travel agent to work with and then from there you can you know advertise on social media promote through you know word of mouth happy clients are always the best advertisement <laughs> uh, so do you do you get foreign clients as well or just from locals i haven't gotten foreign clients <coughs> yet but that's because i'm still you know pretty new to my agency so i'm still working on building my network out you know further mm. from where i live okay um so for instance uh, a foreigner wants to uh how can you help a foreigner for example if i want to visit usa you would just yeah, so all you would have to do would be just go to my website and then just, you know, send me an email address because my um, my work email is on there. And then, you know, from there we could start planning. It's really that simple. So, mm. so, uh, so any foreigner uh, like will search on Google uh, about travel agent in USA and mm -hmm. your website will come up and I open it, 
then I found you, then I find you. Yep, you would just I send me a message you. through my website. Yep. And then we chat. Yep, we just start talking and planning your trip. So. Oh, I see. That's how it works. So how uh -huh. is the payment gateway? What is the payment gateway? Payment gateway for to work with me? Yeah, like to pay, you know? Yeah, so are you saying like, is there like a minimum amount that you need to spend no. to work with me? We live in a different country, so how am I going right. to pay to you, for right. example? Right, so it would be a, uh, a wire transfer. So basically how it would work would be you would pay the hotel once we get everything settled where you want to stay. And then, like I said, the hotel would then give me my commission. So you're not paying me directly. You're still paying the hotel. But then I get a commission from that because you're a more valued client in the hotel's eyes because you used a travel agent. So how, if I book from hotel, how am how they going to know it's you? Because I talk to the hotel for you. This is my client. I'm his agent, you know, Okay. so, and there's, um, every travel agent has what's called an IATA number. <coughs> okay. And it's basically the license number for being a travel agent. So when we're booking your hotel, there's usually a space for me to put in my license number. And that's how the hotel knows that this is a reservation that is connected with a travel agent. Mm. So you get commission from the booking. Yes, exactly. And because the things that I do that wouldn't necessarily be done if you just booked yourself would be, you know, before you, you leave, before you arrive, you know, to your, your destination, your hotel, I'd be calling the hotel the week before for you going, okay, I just want to double check everything. You know, Cheyenne is coming next week. This is the room that we agreed on. I just want to make sure he's going to get all the upgrades and perks that we discussed, the free breakfast, room upgrade, if it's possible. I might throw in a couple of extra things for you as mm -hmm. well, but that would be something me and the hotel would discuss. So that mm -hmm. way, when you arrive, it's just a smooth, seamless check-in and you get to enjoy your trip and know that everything's taken care of. Can you send me a website? I never saw a, a website like this. Yeah, for absolutely. Travel agent. Mm -hmm. So. <coughs> here we go. I thought it's is done only locally. So my agency works yeah. internationally, and a lot of our advisors are international. Okay. I'll I'll check it out. Let's see absolutely. how does it look like. Yeah. So. Okay. So why did you think to, uh, no, no, no. So you wanted to be a travel agent to like, since when? I've always loved travel. So I've been to 18 countries and I'm always Ooh. planning my, yes, I'm always planning my own personal trips. So it was something that I already had expertise in. So it, yeah, mm. it just felt like something I'm already doing. Why not monetize? Can you count all the countries? right now oh okay let me see <laughs> so england france italy germany finland sweden estonia denmark the netherlands russia i feel like i'm forgetting one in europe um where else honduras belize mexico jamaica bahamas did I say Sweden? I can't remember if I said Sweden now. See, any, I lose any, track. <laughs> any country in South Asia or in Asia? Not yet. I want to go um, next year. My, my husband and I are planning a trip to Japan. So okay. that'll be my first time in Asia. I'm very excited. <laughs> okay. So, so far, which was your best country? Ooh, that's a tough one. 
Mm, if I'm going because I want to go see like like artwork and food and everything, Italy, hands down, Italy. Loved it. Yeah. Okay. Italy has Rome, right? Yes. Yes. Rome, <laughs> Florence, Venice, beautiful cities. Venice, the city in the water, right? Yes, it's on the water. So. Yes. Okay. We have a three thing left. Thank you for the lesson. <laughs>